Okay, this is super exciting. Today I'm gonna show you something you probably haven't seen before. Look at these cute snow leopard cups. They are just a few days old. So why am I showing you this? Well, because snow leopards have hardly ever been filmed like this before. So this is really precious footage. The reason is that snow leopards are incredibly hard to spot. There are only about 3000 individuals left in the wild. The harsh conditions of their natural habitat makes them notoriously difficult to find and even harder to study or catch on camera. But recently, our film team got extremely lucky. Filming for a nature documentary high up in the Himalayan mountains, they found a pregnant female and managed to capture intimate scenes of her and her newborns. Until today, only a handful of researchers and filmmakers have had the chance to observe snow leopard cubs in the wild. But today, I can show you this incredible footage and give you insights into the hidden life of this snow leopard family. Let's have a look. It all starts with a male stalking a female. He is ready to mate and sprays his urine onto rocks to mark his territory. He is patient, getting closer to her each day. After a few days, she also shows an interest and they start courting, big cat style. Okay, this part of the footage is a little bit shaky. I guess our film crew was a little bit too excited. But although the footage is wobbly, this is pioneering. Because so far, snow leopard mating scenes have only been captured by camera traps, mostly at night. Three months later, at the end of June, it was clear. Now, the patients involved in carefully following her high up into the mountains to her hidden den had paid off. The camera height was installed at a safe distance, so the snow leopard mother could feel undisturbed and fully enjoy these first days with her newborns. The twins suckle and sleep and are about the size of their mother's paw. Snow leopards can have between one and five cubs, but litters are most commonly two to three. Here, the cubs have just opened their eyes, which are blue for their first few weeks. The female wraps her long furry tail around the cubs, like a fluffy blanket. Eat, sleep, repeat is the current motto of the twins. For food, they totally rely on their mother because milk is all they got right now. Our team saw that the mother had made a proper kill before giving birth, but they also knew that she would have to leave the den to hunt again soon. This meant that the cubs would stay behind alone. Snow leopard parents don't raise their cubs together. The male leaves right after mating. Luckily, this mother has some babysitters around. They are quite unconventional, but you have to take what you can get, right? Her den is above a natural salt lick in the cliffs, which these barrel or blue sheep visit regularly. They are nervous and act as the snow leopard's lookouts. They will call if a bear, wolf or male snow leopard comes near. When the female leaves the den to hunt, she always checks whether the barrel are still there and calm. The cameras show that when the mother starts her journey downwards, she will slip quietly away while the twins are playing. While it's still time to stay snuggled up in the sheltered cave at 5000 meters, the plateau down below is already full of life, with lots of prey around. A single meal will keep her going for weeks, which is good because high up in the mountains, the cubs are already getting bored. The siblings spend most of their waking hours playing. The male is larger, but his little sister is quite a wrestler and in no way inferior to him. For both, the fascination of the outside world is getting bigger and bigger. The male is ready to set foot outside. Now it is his sister's turn. Not the best time to go out. A male leopard is nosing around. He passes close to the den. Males often kill young that they don't recognize as their own. The two cubs are back at their base, but are they safe? Luckily, a magpie has showed up. This scavenger bird discovered the den before the male did. He has a stroll around and notices there is no food left. As the magpie takes off again, the male snow leopard follows him to the potential next meal. The twins are safe. Sadly, the night changed everything. The next morning, the family den was totally empty. Our team was shocked and asking themselves all kinds of questions. What happened at night? Where were the two cubs? Had the intruder returned? 
In this harsh environment, their chances of survival weren't good. The camera frames stayed empty. The team helped put up some prayer flags, thinking of the cops. Weeks passed by without any sighting. But luckily, after some time, the mother returned. She had made another kill. Normally, a mother snow leopard would lead her cubs to a kill for their first taste of meat, but there was still no sign of them. The majority of cubs died in their first year, so there was not much hope left. But days later, and half a kilometer away, one of the twins has been spotted again. It's the female, the little wrestler. She is trying to make her own way back to the den. This time, she really needs to fight. She is shaking. Her muscles must be jelly. She calls desperately for her mother. To make matters worse, the clouds draw in and the storm begins. So she is trapped. It really looks like a family tragedy. But months later, the unbelievable happens. A snow leopard is calling. The cameras are set up again. It is the mother. And in an amazing surprise, a cub joins her. And another one. The family has been reunited and all of them are safe and sound. Honestly, we don't know how the female cub was rescued from the cliff or how the mother found the male cub again. We don't have a single picture of it, but we do know that all of the other footage wouldn't have been possible without these three yak farmers. They were able to follow the mountain queen in one of the toughest places on earth because they know these animals better than anyone. They grew up with them here in the Himalayas. And although the local yak herders had been battling snow leopards for generations, these men have embarked a new path. Hi friends, thanks for watching. If you like this kind of content, please let us know in the comments below because we do have much more cool footage left.